dance was at some points fun to watch. I think your dance clearly was a fan favorite. The audience went wild. It was good to dance with another partner for you. Uh, you seem to adapt to these partnerships very well, going from Charlie to Max to Val. You know, I think in this particular, well, I mean, I've had amazing partners. I think it's important for me to say Charlie, Max, Val, they're all incredibly different, but I think in terms of being able to work with them, in terms of just the genuine people that they are, I, I couldn't have, you know, three more amazing people, so I feel very lucky. What does it say about Charlie and Max that they're probably two of the happiest people in a competition to see you get these high scores? Oh, uh, it, it makes me feel good. Uh, <laughs> it's it, I, it's not a surprise to me. That's why I, I mean I know I know that I know that it's something that's been communicated in the past and it's something that's reciprocated by me. I I'm very very upset about Charlie's uh, scores and comments. I'm very upset about Max's scores and comments, uh, and I'm I'm glad that we. We got to represent our team because that's our team. The six of us are, are people that love one another very much and want to see each other do very well. You were called untouchable tonight. Do you like that or does that put stress on you? I mean, I, th I certainly think that it's a compliment. Um, I don't know. I think the key to competition is never feeling untouchable and always feeling like you're really only competing against yourself and trying to improve. And I think for me, that's what this competition is all about, you know, doing something I don't know how to do well and learning and improving and feeling good about, you know, my progress. Should they do the switch up ever again on this show? I, uh, I like it. I like it. I love Meryl. I had a brilliant time with her. I'm, I'm very grateful for the opportunity to, to create that because, you know, obviously she's one of a kind when it comes to her uh, capabilities. But at the same time, I was very excited to be paired up with Amy. Uh, that's a challenge that I was really, really itching to have the opportunity to, to face. Uh, Candace is a beautiful person. We're great friends. Uh, Nini would have been a blast. So, I mean, I, I love this cast. I, you know, when I walk into the, the room as a teacher, as a partner, you know, I have a responsibility. I'm an ambassador for, for a world that, that I grew up in, that I'm very proud of, that they are coming in vulnerable to, and, I, and, I, and it's my responsibility to make sure that they get everything out of it. That, that's my priority. That's what I think about. Meryl, you are very calm, and I don't know if that's a key, because it's like he tells you something and you probably calculate it and take it in your head and then give it back to him on the ballroom floor or in the rehearsal hall. Is that your process? I don't know if that's true. Is that true? What? Am I calm? Did you you are... Time? George, I, I, was, I was very tough on her this week. Very, very tough. <laughs> very tough on her, on me, on us. Uh, I felt like we had an opportunity to do some great things and I wanted to seize that opportunity for both of us. And so we worked really hard. Uh, she definitely kept, kept the anchor down. I asked her to. I came to her many occasions like, baby, let, let me stress for the both of us. Be calm. You know, and she, she's a great partner. She's a great teammate. Last question for you both. The magical world of Disney heads into the ballroom on Monday night. Okay, so that's a yes from you. Is that a yes from you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Is there a Disney child inside you? Honestly, no, not really. I swear to God, I, I didn't. There's a Disney child inside of all of us. I, no, there, there it is, there it is. Uh, I am more of a political science newspaper article type of dude since I was like 10 years old. So, yeah, I, I'm too cynical for cartoons, I don't know why. Fiction in general. I like non-fiction things.